Hey, it's Jorge from Team JVS giving you another world exclusive premiere of a movie called Venus. This is, this was just a wild movie. I'll read you some of the quick synopsis here. Um, when go-go dancer Lucia uh, nicks a fortune in designer drugs from her mafia employee, the mobsters dodge pursuit forces to seek her sanctuary with her estranged sister, uh, Rocio and niece Alba. In, uh, in the Venus, a descriptive apartment complex on the outskirts of Madrid. Um, this movie is just, <laughs> just when you think like, you know, like normal horror movies and what they're about, this goes and takes like four or five left turns on you. Um, in such a, a cool and crazy way. Um, I, I will say some of the, the freakier parts in this movie do, do a great job. Um, especially in the way that the director caught some of the, the scenes and some of the angles. Um, some of the gory stuff is just, is just crazy and out there. Um, but overall, you know, they, they, <laughs> you know, once you know, the sister steals, you know, all these drugs. Um, she ends up getting, you know, like stabbed at one point. And when she goes in, you know, meets her sister, um, obviously you can tell they're not like in great speaking terms or anything like that, but her sister obviously helps her out, you know, like kind of cleans her wound and all this. Um, but you can tell there's a lot of weird things happening in this apartment complex. Um, and I believe the actual apartment complex is called the Venus, um, which is, which is unique. Um, but you, you, you start seeing it and you start kind of going through it and there's something really wrong with this apartment complex. There's not a lot of people who live there. Um, and the people who do live there, you you always are encountering very weird interactions with them. Uh, the thing that gets really weird is, you know, throughout the some nights, um, excuse me, throughout some nights, you know, there there's these crazy noises that start happening. Um, and it's just bonkers, like just what, what ends up happening throughout this movie. Um, normally, I would say this is like a horror movie, but... It's like a horror sci-fi, you know, movie at the end of it is kind of how I would, you know, kind of put it all together. Um, I will say like there's some scenes where the way people die are are just awesome. Um, at the end of the day, that, that's the nicest way I'll put it, are just awesome. Um, the director did have some extremely cool shots, um, like the close to the end, like near the last scenes, like near the finale, there's some shots that are taken that kind of go from overhead, um, instead of like your, your natural, you know, like looking straight at something, which, which were done so well, um, throughout the movie, you really don't see what this entity is until near the end. And once you see it, it's just like, it's wild. Like th this movie is just wild. Um, it it's hard to put into words and, and express it, but yeah, this is, this is one to definitely go watch. Um, the cast did a, did an awesome job. The way that everything was, was kind of done up was was great um this is a, a spanish film so just be be on the lookout on that so there are subtitles in this i'm sure they'll be dubbed you know here shortly but overall like the i haven't seen a horror movie like this i don't think ever i'm, I'm trying to think and i'm i'm not sure um but this was just a wild movie um hats off to the director and and you know, like the the cast of this, especially uh, Lucia. I mean, she she did such a great job uh, throughout the whole movie, and, and even the little girl did a great job. Like the niece, um, Alba, she she also did a really good job. 
but I would say, you know, this just for just because of how how different it is, you know, I would rank this, you know, 8.5 out of 10 just because it was done very different and you really didn't know what was happening till the very end. And then when you when you think you know what's about to happen, it just it takes another turn and you basically are hit with a lot of unexpected. Um which is awesome the way that they do it and just the way that everything flows. You know, I definitely, like I said, highly recommend it. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think about this one when you guys watch it. Uh, let me know what some of your favorite scenes are. But yeah, other than that, this is Jorge from Team JVS and we'll see you next time. Peace.